Hello there, my name is Luyolo Lenga. I'm a bow music player and a bow music teacher. And uh, in this video, we're going to teach you how to play Uadi Kalabash Bow. Um, this instrument belongs to a class of instruments which is known as chordophones, meaning stringed instruments. So, the sound or is originated by the vibration of the string. Therefore, it travels through the stick, and then this calipers here acts as a resonator to amplify the tone. So, I'm going to show you how to hold the instruments first. Um, you use your hand, um, depending whether you are left or handed or right handed. But I'm right handed, so I'm going to hold with my left, so I can use my right hand to beat with my stick with my crust stick. So the point is to be able to hold the instrument with a firm grip, like you can go all a seven like this, and then we have these three fingers to hold, and then we have these two fingers which will both be on one side of the stick to stop the string and then let go. And right here we play between two fundamental tones. We have one open fundamental, and then we have a closed fundamental. You hear? So, according to uh, the Kosa rule of playing the instrument, uh, the difference between one fundamental tone to the other has to be a whole tone apart. With the Zulu music, it is different. It becomes a semitone apart. And uh, with Tsonga music, uh, Shangan music of Mozambique, it is a whole tone and a semitone apart. So I'm going to demonstrate for you um, how to play the Uwadibo. You use um, this grass as a beater. You hold this grass as if you are holding, um, what do you call these things that you use to eat Chinese food? Chopsticks. Chopsticks, yes. So that it becomes easy for you to beat instead of using your wrist. Perhaps you might get uh, um, fatigued easily and quickly. So. You also have to be aware that there are overtones that are created uh, uh, whenever you strike one fundamental tone, you will get a chord of it. And the second one, it will also give you a chord of it. Therefore, you have six tones for which you will use to create your music. A hexatonic scale, which is a scale that Tosa music uses. I'm going to play a song for you, uh, composed by Matosini. Uh, which is called Kukute Mambondwe. There you go.